On July 4th, 1776, our nation's forefathers signed the Declaration of Independence. Yes, Crandall. Did signing the Declaration put an end to the war? Sadly, no, Crandall. Freedom was only won after a long and difficult struggle. Just saying you're free does not make you free. I hope you all have a wonderful Independence Day. And while you celebrate, keep in mind the sacrifices others made to defend our freedom. My whole family's coming over for a barbecue blowout. We're having frittatas, then watching fireworks. My grandparents came to town. Crandall, isn't that your grandpa? Oh, boy. Afternoon, kids. Hop on, Cap. I'm your ride home. Uh, please don't call me Cap when I'm not in uniform. Not everyone knows. Sorry, C Crandall. Now, hop on. You sure old Bessie can handle both of us? Don't you worry about old Bessie. <laughs> Come on, girl. Giddy up. Go ahead, Crandall. I think you really like wearing a helmet. Now, isn't this better than walking? We're practically flying. You sure are. This is a two-wheel pink at QRS. <sighs> you kids hear that? Hear what, Grandpa Gordon? Hmm. Maybe Bessie just needs a new muffler. Comrade Z, I have triangulated the Silver Shield's thermal signature. Excellent. Soon my old war nemesis will be captured and we can initiate Project Threeville. <laughs> Your Zenis, we have picked up several other off-world thermal signatures also as well. That is why we are here. Comrade Y, hoist the iron shower curtain. <laughs> Come on, Crandall, pick a card, any card. No thanks, Grandpa Nick. Why not? Because you've already played this trick on me 46 times. I have? Yes, no matter what card I pick, it's going to be the Ten of Clubs. Did you say the Ten of Clubs? Not again. That shaking gave me a headache. I think I better go lie down. Let freedom ring! Too bad Grandpa Gordon isn't feeling well. I guess he just isn't used to this kind of excitement. Uh, sorry, everyone. I have to take this call. could be so urgent. The burgers are almost ready. Yeah, please be excused, Earth Mom. I hope you're hungry, Jean. Solid iron. Reinforced by an invisible force field to boot. Remote controlled. Who's behind all this? Epsilon, are you in there? Shh, they call me Chief now. My apologies. So, Chief, do you still have all your old war spy files? This way.
Purple Menace, in jail. Tommy Trader, in jail. Comrade Z, in... Paroled last week for good behavior. Comrade Z, good? Impossible. We'll have to inform the governor. And I have a job for you too, Epsilon. This is Comrade Z. Your state is now confined within my iron shower curtain. Defy me, and you will face other consequences, too consequential to be mentioned at this point in time. My conditions are simple. My conditions are one. Surrender the silver shield to me immediately. Better still, sooner than that. Let go! Who does this guy think he is? I don't know, but he's gone too far. He's poco loco en el coco. Indeed. Silver shield! That's right. Glad to see you kids on duty. Not when I'm in uniform. Drag City Shield, Comrade Z won't lower the iron shower curtain until you surrender. Obviously. With me out of the way, nothing can stop his plan to change our way of life. You, you, you! Don't tell him! Let me ask you a question. Is it always about you? I can't help it if I'm more popular than you. Grandpas, please! We have a major crisis on our hands. Fear not. I have a plan. This ought to be good. But first, you need to be trained. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Arsp! Arsp! The American Association of Retired Superpersons. This is where we train. These old persons were superheroes? Don't you recognize the ginormous knight, Commander Tiny, or Mr. Sometimes? Ah, uh, should we? Hail and well met, Timo Supremo. Which one is Commander Tiny? He is. Ahoy there, Dark Talon. So, are you Mr. Sometimes? Sometimes. And this is not so lazy, Susan. Hey! -ya! Did I get him? Yeah, that walker never had a chance. I've still got it, because I'm not lazy. Here we are. Now let's see you tackle the obstacle course without your level seven gizmos. Go! What are we doing this? Maybe it's to make us better appreciate our super tools. See how nothing stops him? Boy, does that kid take after me. This is kind of fun. As long as you don't fall in. Why are we using this old-fashioned rope when I have a perfectly good level seven rope? Good question, rope girl. Bazaar! There, did you see the way he flew? That's so me, it's not funny. Oh, really? What you got there, Epsilon? Just the plans for Comrade Z's flying fortress. Well done, Epsilon. Why, thank you, Silver Shield. Okay, Timo, gather round. Here's a plan. Dark Talon and I will take Comrade Z and his like-minded comrades. Wait a second, what do we do? You sneak through the air duct, into the master tech room, and disable the iron shower curtain. We can do that. Everyone set. What if something goes wrong? Nothing will go wrong if you follow the plan. But if something does go wrong, we'll give you a signal. Do you think your grandpas can handle Comrade Z alone? I hope so. That was cool. Yeah, thanks, Cap. No problem. Now let's disable that iron shower curtain. Remember us, Comrade Z? Here to surrender, are you? Oh, and a bonus. You brought the Dark Talon. We're not here to surrender. We brought you to justice once, and we're here to do it again. Oh, well. V? Sound the alarm! Look at that! Is this all you've got, Z? We interrupted our respective retirements for this? Gee, yo! They're doomed! We never should have used their plan. Now we've got to save them. What about the iron shower curtain? We'll deal with that later. Come on, Timo! Get them! Now? Wait for it. Now. Timo Supremo! 
No, not now. What are you doing here? Rescuing you? We don't need rescuing. Oh, we do now. You know you'll never win, Z. But I am winning. And while phase one of my really, really big plan is now complete, I will only be satisfied when I have completed phase two! Moments ago on Timo Supremo, the state was sealed behind an iron shower curtain. The nefarious Comrade Z demanded an immediate surrender of the Silver Shield, then attempting to infiltrate Comrade Z's flying fortress. Our heroes were captured! And now, Timo Supremo! And so, on this July 4th, Comrade Z will unveil his declaration of dependence! You see, freedom is overrated. What's overrated about being able to make your own choices? What if it's the wrong choice? Then what? You're stuck, little free boy. But if it's the right choice, you at least get the satisfaction of having done something on your own. Ah, you don't get it. Do not worry, Comrade B. Once I take over, everyone will be happy, even if we have to make them be. And now, on to phase two of my plan. With you five freedom freaks out of the way, I will now proceed to conquer the state, then the nation, the continent, and finally, the world! Won't that take more than two phases? I count five! No insolence! You'll never succeed, Comrade Z. Do not be so sure. After I initiate Project Three Will, no one will question my rule. I will. I will. I will. I will. I will. I will. Says you, come. You will have a front row seat to watch and see. Little Bo Peep has lost her sheep. She'll know where to find them. Uh, was that a senior moment? as the resistance crumbles, like one of those crumbly crumb cake thingies you people enjoy with your variety of overpriced coffees. So much for your way of doing things. We're outside the school where Comrade Z's men have just... Hey, stop! Oh, look at that. Get a load of that. Get your mitts off of me, dag nabbit! Seen enough, Comrade Shiny? None of this would have happened if you and Grandpa Gordon hadn't been overwhelmed by Comrade Z's guards. Overwhelmed? We had those guards exactly where we wanted them. That's crazy talk! Yeah, you were about to be captured and everything. Wait a second, Timo. What are you saying, Grandpa Nick? I'm saying that we were playing possum to draw as many guards away from you as possible. So we could deactivate the iron shower curtain. Precisely. I was about to spring our trap when you pups busted in and ruined the whole shebang. Whoop! Oops! Gee, ow. Buzz! Oh, guess I should have listened. I guess so. Fortunately, all is not lost. That last message from Silver Shield was not a senior moment. It was code. Code? Cool. We're supposed to break out of here, rescue Silver Shield, and bring Comrade Z to justice. How are we going to do that? Watch and learn, Sonny Boy. Hmm. The wall seems to be made of a newfangled polymer, impervious to burning or cutting. How are we going to get out of it, Simple? Harry. The old fangled way. We'll use the door. Dartalon, you are the greatest. I know. 
But don't tell the Silver Shield that. Now, let's retrieve our super tools. Yikes. Now, according to Epsilon's map, C's probably storing our stuff here. Giselle! How are we gonna get him? Wait a second. This course is just like the one we trained on. I thought that training might come in handy. Chica! Let's do it! Z never misses a trick. All set, Dark Talon. Good. Now I have a new plan for you. And this time, follow it exactly. Yes, sir. You can rely on us. Chip off the old block. draw the guards away from the control room and then shut down the iron shower curtain. And this time, nothing can stop us. You see? If you had simply accepted my supreme rule, none of this would be happening. We would all be living in enforced peace and harmony, just doing things my way. But no, you and your precious principles. Well, look what it's gotten you. Think your fellow citizens are caring about freedom now? They probably wish they'd never heard of the word. Who said you could speak? No one, Comrade Z. Yes. Fortunately for you, that was the right answer. Otherwise, you would soon be shoveling snow in Gabonsk. Bazaar! Demo Supremo! Chica! <laughs> Sound the alarm! <laughs> Guards, to the tech room. I thought I sent you to take care of those kids. Maybe, but I thought... You thought? I thought someone should stay behind to make sure the prisoners escape. <laughs> It can ring all it likes. But in the end, it will ring hollow. But Now to draw back the iron shower curtain. It's currently curtains for that curtain for certain. Yes, and now that our part of the mission's complete, let's see if we can help catch Comrade Z! Don't let them spoil my plan! What freedom reign! Freedom fast! You fight on the wrong side, my friend. What's wrong with being taken care of? It's so much easier! You talk too much! You still have not defeated me! No previous chair! Stupid hero types! Great Grady, he's getting away! And we can't fit through that portal! We can! Glad you could make it, kids. The pleasure's ours. Or it will be once we catch Comrade Z! Timo You're not going anywhere, Comrade Z! That is what you are thinking. Timo, after him! I knew you were going to say that. Timo Supremo! We're just in range. Powers are kicked in, but oh well. Ah! 
Yes! And now you're going down, Comrade Z! But that! You may have grounded me, but not my really, really, really big plan. You'll never win. Z! We'll see how you enjoy your lack of freedom. In jail! I am not through yet. You will see. Your precious freedom is still but a fragile thing. That's true, Comrade Z. Our freedom can never be taken for granted. We must always remember those who defended it before us and listen to what they have to say. And now that the duty of protecting freedom is ours, those who hate it better look out for... Tito Supremo! Howdy, everybody! It's Rope Girl! And I just want to take a second and wish you a happy holiday! And like I always say, kick off them boots and enjoy the day! Okay, <laughs> that's it. <laughs> you can go back to what you were doing. This is Rope Girl saying whoop -a! And happy holidays! <laughs>